Hi, I'm Donna Wolf from Nastasia.com. Today, I'll show how to crochet a toilet paper hat cover. I'm using less than 100 yards of Red Heart Super Saver and a size H crochet hook. To begin, make a slip knot and chain four. Slip stitch to the first chain to form a ring. For round one, chain two, which does not count as a stitch. In this ring, make 12 double crochet stitches. We're going to work in spiral rounds, so for round two, just make two double crochet stitches in the first stitch. And always mark your first stitch so you know where each round begins. In each stitch, we're going to make two double crochet stitches. Two double crochet. Continue working around with this pattern. For round three, continue working in spirals. In the first stitch, we're going to do two double crochet stitches. Replace the stitch marker. Next, do one double crochet. We repeat this pattern again, two double crochet, followed by one double crochet, two double crochet, and one double crochet. Continue with this pattern around. For round four, we're going to do one more row of increases. In the first stitch, make two double crochet stitches and replace the stitch marker. Next, make one double crochet in the next stitch and one more double crochet in the next stitch. At this point, the circle should just about cover the top of the toilet paper. If it doesn't fit right, you might need to start over and use a larger hook to make it larger or a smaller hook to make it smaller. For rounds five, six, seven, and eight, we're just going to continue working in spirals. We'll just make one double crochet around in each stitch. It's important to still mark your first stitch so you know where each round begins. At the end of the eight rounds, Try your hat cover on the toilet paper. For rounds 9 and 10, I'm going to change colors. To change colors, I like to make a slip stitch in the next stitch and switch colors at that time. Chain 3. With this new color yarn, make one double crochet around in each stitch. You can see what this looks like. At the end, make a slip stitch to the top of the chain three. And for round 10, chain three, and continue with making one double crochet in each stitch around. As we move on to rounds 11 and 12, which forms the ruffle brim, I'm switching back to the original lighter pink color at this time. Chain three. For round 11, make two double crochet stitches in each stitch around. This will really flare out the brim part nicely. Continue with this two double crochet in each stitch around. For round 12, we'll start with the chain three. For this round, we're going to make one double crochet around in each stitch. At the end, just slip stitch to the chain three. You can sew on a button or flower or bow for a decoration. And that's how I make my toilet paper hat cover. To get more videos like this, please subscribe to my YouTube channel.